Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another live vintage sale at Over the Years. My name is Tim. Thank you for joining me. Um, I am once again riding solo dolo. Uh, it is Josie's mom's birthday. So if you hear women screaming, loud music, and you could smell the delicious food. It's because they're downstairs partying like it's 1999. So today I have brought you guys a whole slew of cool stuff. Um, I got a lot of uranium glass today, a lot of Vaseline glass, some Fenton, some Balik. Um, a couple interesting pieces that are like just came out of nowhere. I brought you guys some of my favorite items. What else did I bring? I brought you guys some like steal of a deal prices for sure. Um, so I'm super excited for tonight's sale. Uh, I want to thank everybody from the bottom of my heart. Like, I, I know some of you that also do live sales understand like how much work this really is uh, for me. Um, like I, I today I got up, you know, at seven o'clock in the morning and I had to pack all my orders from eBay, Etsy, Macari, Poshmark, Grail, Depop. And then I have to go to my storage unit and I have to pick up pick out, I have to pick out 40 things. I just randomly walk through my storage unit and just grab stuff. And I'm like, I think they'll like this. I think they'll like that. So, and then I have to pack all that up. And basically I bring it back to, to uh, wherever I'm doing the live sale from. Um, and today I'm doing the live sale from Josie's house um, because it is the internet at my, at my Duke's house has been, bugging out lately so just trying to keep keep the internet good enough to show you guys these items uh shout out to everybody that's watching right now on facebook if you guys are um watching on facebook you if you're watching it on my personal page you won't be able to make bids uh, or you won't be able to purchase anything because i cannot see the comments from facebook on my personal page so you either have to watch on over the years um facebook page or join us on youtube um but yeah let me just go ahead and say some hellos to some people i know uh people are kind of just uh popping in slowly but surely i know uh george does his premieres um at the same time so i know those uh a lot of people like to watch those as well so without further ado let's say some hellos hello 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 all right april was first in the building Shout out to April Davis. She says, finally, missed most of the previous show while driving, but I'm here. Thank you. We appreciate your support. Vintage and vinyl always shows up. Thank you very much. Carrie, Casey Addicts, you're amazing. I can't thank you. Your support is tremendous. Michelle, as always, nothing but love for Michelle. Judy, how you doing, Judy? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Victoria's here. Patrick, the man that created this monster. That, that is happening right now. Uh, big shout out to Patrick. He's got a great channel. I'm sure everybody in the chat is already subscribed to him. But if you're watching this and you're not, I highly suggest you subscribe to Patrick, the trusty huckster mercantile. Um, Chicago lady is here. How you doing? Joanne, bougie and the beast. I love that name. Oh, my vintage. Oh, my vintage. Oh, my vintage. And Tim says hello to Tim. Good to see you, buddy. Uh, so, yeah, we got uh, 24 people in the chat right now. Uh, just so everybody knows, if this is your first time with us at the Over the Years Live Vintage Sale, I'm going to go ahead and – what's going on, Lisa and Rob? And that's another channel. Man, Lisa and Rob – Nobody has more fun on YouTube than Lisa and Rob. So, and, and they are like power sell sellers. They sell 
everything on every platform. So make sure you guys are subscribed to Lisa and Rob because they they're getting close to one thousand, and I can't wait for the party once they hit one thousand. <laughs> it's gonna be so much fun. Um, so yeah. So if this is your first time, Kathy's in the building. How you doing, Kathy? If this is your first time with us for a live sale, I'm going to give you guys a quick little rundown on how this works. So basically, I'm going to show you an item, and then I will have a card, and the card will have a number on it. Uh, we'll have a price on the card, and then I will reveal the number. And the first person that types the number that is on the card in the chat will win that item. Once you have won an item, what you do is, is you will email us at the email that is scrolling across the bottom of the screen right now. Email your PayPal information and mailing address to otyislive at gmail.com and then um, tomorrow morning, we pack up all the items that were purchased uh, once we receive your um, email and shipping address, and then we will send you an invoice. Once that invoice is paid, your package will be shipped out, and then you will receive a uh, tracking number. And once again, we are shipping from Maryland. If you, uh, just so you know, we do our best to make sure that we can get you guys the lowest possible price when it comes to shipping without sacrificing the arrival of your item. So a couple more shout outs really fast. And uh, I guess we can go ahead and get started because, you know, it, who's here first should have first dibs, right? Patty, what's going on? How are you doing today? And it will be a great party, I promise. Oh, I know it will be. I can't wait. <laughs> and then Tracy, you know, if it wasn't for Tracy, I'd probably still be sitting at like 300 subs. So shout out to Tracy. Um, she's been a huge supporter, a great friend, um, and more than just reselling. So got to show some love to Tracy. And I know I saw Glenn in here. What's going on, Glenn? How you doing? Buying space. Yes, thank you. I hate having to beg for a tracking number. No, we send out tracking numbers. It's super important for us. Uh, we we want to be able to provide everybody with as much um, you know, quality as possible. And Jackie, another one of our favorites here. How you doing, Jackie? And Carolina Lady. All right. So let me – oh, yeah, and you have to bear with me because, like I said, I'm by myself. My Dukes is in here. Josie's downstairs partying. It's her mom's birthday. So um, I'm going to try and grab, like, I got, like, a little bit of a walk to where all the items are. I'm going to try and grab as many at one time as I can. Um, and then we will get this party started. All right. All right, all right. Okay, so first item up on the docket tonight is going to be, just make sure I have my chat pulled up over here so I can announce the winners. So the first item up is going to be this absolutely gorgeous, it's like, a, it's basically amethyst glass. It's this really nice dark purple smoked glass and as you can see, it is crackle glass. Um, to me, crackle glass is super underrated. There are definitely a lot of collectors out there. Um, the maker of this, I'm not 100% sure. Uh, if I had to make a guess, I would say it's probably Kanawa or Blanco maybe. Um, they were uh, some of the heavier producers of crackle glass um, during that time. Um, and you can see it is hand-blown glass. And it's kind of cool because I have the light here. So you can kind of see, get an idea of how this looks with the light. Uh, just one of those pieces where I always try to tell people, like, there's so much that you can do with this piece. You know, you could put flowers in it. You could just put it as is in your windowsill. 
Um, if you're an artist, you could put paintbrushes in there. I mean, there's just so much versatility in a piece like this. And it's just, you're not going to be able to find this crackle glass, you know, in the, in the store. So it's just, it's a really nice piece and I'm going to be giving it away. Everything today is priced crazy. I'm basically giving you guys anywhere from 25 to 50% off of my listing, uh, prices. So this is going to be the first item. This is a crackle glass, amethyst crackle glass vase. And this item can be yours for a price of only $9 with the number five. Kanawa. Yes, Kanawa. Kanawa. That's, what, that's how I said it. Kanawa glass. Five is the number nine dollars is the price for the amethyst crackle glass vase all right and then at the end we will give everyone a chance who might pop in and out if they would like to take a stab at items that were not claimed. All right. The next item up. Oh, Bougie and the Beast. Congratulations. You are the winner. All right. Douge. All right. Mm hmm. All right, so, oh, you collect Crackle Glass? Oh, man. My Dukes loves Crackle Glass. Speaking of Crackle Glass, here we go. This is another really gorgeous piece. Um, I'm a big fan of Amberina and Crackle Glass, as I just said. So you can, you know, you can get this piece which is just you can see coming through the light like just look at that piece it is gorgeous amberina and i also believe this to be kanawa glass uh, which was made in west virginia really nice mid-century modern and this piece measures to be about six inches six and a quarter inches really really nice piece uh, yes, Carolina lady, very, very pretty. So this can also be yours. Amberina Crackle Glass Cruet can be yours for a price of only $9 with the number 52. Number 52 gets you the Amberina Crackle Glass Cruet. Carolina lady, you are the winner. Congratulations. Really nice piece. All right. Time to grab two more pieces for you, ladies and gentlemen. All right, next up, we have classic Fire King Peach Lusterware Swirl. These are like, um, they're like mini casserole dishes, I think is what they're actually referred to as. Um, these are really nice. And from handle to handle, they measure to be about six inches. Um, and you do get both of them, and they are marked on the bottom, Anchor Hawking Fire King. Uh, and most importantly, the luster is in very good condition. There's a little bit of wear on that one, as you can see right there. It's very, very small, but, you know, I like to try and point those out to everybody. But for most importantly, the luster is pretty much intact. And these are just... Once again, you don't have to use these for cooking. You can do anything you want to do with these. And I just think that, you know, that sort of pop from that orange lusterware, it's very creamsicle. 
If anybody's a Tampa Bay Buccaneers fan, these are really cool cream sickle anchor hawking fire king dishes. And you can have both of those for a price of only nine dollars with the number 54. Number 54 gets you peach luster swirl fire king anchor hawking two, not just one, but two. Connie. You are the winner. Congratulations to Connie. Ooh. Connie Ainsley, congratulations. All right. Next up. I think everybody loves these. I mean, they're just, they're classic. This is a cool little uh, OJ carafe. And I like this one because... A lot of times you see them, they're a little bit larger. Um, I think this one's kind of cool because it's like if it's just you out on the pool deck or just you out on the porch, you know, you just need a little solo mimosa sort of thing going on. Or if it's you and, and one other person, you guys are drinking mimosas, having brunch on the back porch early Saturday, Sunday morning, you know, you can't beat it. This is just, you know, classic sort of mid-century modern vibe era OJ carafe. Um, this one actually measures to be, uh, it's about six and three fourths inches tall. So if you like OJ and you like these cool little carafes, then you're going to love this. It can be yours for a price of only $5. $5 gets you your own individual mimosa carafe, number 10. Number 10, $5, OJ Mimosa Carafe. Oh, Patrick coming in for the win. Congratulations, sir. You are the winner. All right. We are about to fly through this next two pieces. All right. So you might have gotten a sneak peek at this piece as I was going over how this whole live sale works. But, oh, Maria, you got your scale. Thank you. I'm so glad to hear that. Hope everything's getting better out there on the West Coast for you guys. This is a really interesting piece. Okay, so most people know Noritake as like a, a China. Um, and this is actually stoneware made by Noritake. And you guys can see the marking right there. Oh, why won't you focus, though? There it goes. Noritake Stoneware. Um, the name of this pattern color is called uh, Warm Sands. That's what it's called. And this is a nice creamer. Now, this is one of those things where it's like if you have those sort of like, you know, calming tones in your kitchen or your pantry uh, it, it, it just, it kind of fits in with that sort of, um, theme and, and, and color schematic. It, it just has like this really warmness to it that I really enjoy. I think, you know, the colors obviously pop out here on the rim, but I think what really makes this sets this piece off is how it has the color that goes around the rim too. Obviously this is fully functional as well. Um, it just has a, once again, a lot of the pieces that I, that I show you guys are going to have a lot of versatility. I mean, this can be used. This can be used. Um, this can be displayed. You can have this in your log cabin. You can have this on your beach house. It it's, it's just shows so much versatility to me. Um, I actually have this piece listed, I think, for like $29, $29.99 or something like that uh, right now. But like I said, I, I'm just pulling things off the shelves in a storage unit and trying to give everybody a good price. So Nortaki Stoneware Warm Sands Creamer. 
Uh, let me get to a measurement really quick. It's going to be about uh, three and three fourths inches tall. And then spout to handle is about five inches. So Nortaki stoneware can be yours for a price of only $9. If you give me number one, number one gets you the Nortaki stoneware. Nortaki Stoneware, $9 with the number one. All right. We'll save that guy for later. Okay. This next item is super interesting. Now, this is another item that I have already priced up right now. Um, these are mid-century modern. I guess you would consider them to be crochet. They're like, they're drink sleeves. And they're made for like those sort of Tom Collins glasses. I wonder if my Red Bull would fit in there. Yeah. Uh, so they're like drink sleeve coasters. You just kind of put them down like that. Uh, they're definitely fit like a Tom Collins sort of glass or a zombie glass, however you refer to those glasses are. Yeah, they're drink sleeve coasters. Um, and these are, they have like the, you know, a nice sort of, uh, sparkle to them. There's a green one. You got a navy blue one. You get this like salmon color one. And you get this like retro brown one. And you get this sort of olive green one. So you get five in total. You get five of these cozy, koozy coasters, koozy crochet coaster sleeves. You get all five of these. Super mid-century modern, too. Look at, this, look at that, how that, that thing glows. It's crazy. It has, like, this nice little sparkle to them. And these are, like, you know, they're, like, crocheted. Pretty rad stuff. So, crazy deal. Crazy deal, guys. $7. Give me number two. Oh, I dropped one. Here we go. Number two, $7. All five of these. These things are pretty red. I'm telling you. All five, $7. Number two. All right. We will move on to the next item. All right. Boom. All right. So next up, this is a uh, Balik. We love Balik. Um, it's one of those things that I remember Ma Dukes um, having around a lot when I was young growing up. Uh, and this is also pretty awesome because it comes with the box. Not a ton. It's like finding boxes for older things is always super difficult. So if you plan on reselling something like this, you know, the opportunity to get an even better price is going to come by having the box with it as well. And this uh, Balik piece, I believe the marking is from 93. Um, and it actually comes with like a cool little uh, card from the visitor's center in, um, in Ireland, which is pretty rad. <laughs> Now, this piece probably sells for anywhere between uh, $25 to $45. I've seen it online. And, I mean, this, this still has the sticker on the bottom, too, from the gift shop, which is pretty crazy. There it is. And then you can see it has the Balik marking. 
The name of this is Winter Rose is the name of the pattern of, on this Balik piece. And you can see it right there. Really nice. And it is on two sides. And the rest of the sides have like this traditional uh, basket weave part. Really nice sort of shape up top. Um, has the gold trim around it. And this is, like I said, probably sells right now on the market for anywhere between like 30 and $40, give or take. And this is going to come with the box. And well, I guess I should keep it out to show you guys as I tell you the number. <clears throat> All right. Balik Winter Rose. Oh, and I guess for those of you that want to know, this is a candle votive. Uh, it does measure a little pinch higher than two and a half inches, and it is approximately two and three fourths inches wide. Balik Winter Rose candle votive with the box can be yours for a price of only twelve dollars with the number forty-three. Number forty-three gets you the Balik Winter Rose. Candle votive with the box two. So, boom. Box votive number 43 for $12. Balik Winter Rose Candle Votive. Oh, we have a winner. Stacy. Congratulations, Stacy. You are the winner. Winner, winner. Balik Dinner. Congratulations, Stacy. All right. Let me grab the next couple of items. All right, two more items up. Here we go, here we go, here we go. All right, you guys know I love green glass. You guys know I love like all types of stuff. This is a rad piece. Um, it's kind of crazy because there's like a manufacturer flaw in here and I'm not quite sure what it is. I don't know if something got stuck in there when they were blowing the glass, but it's super rad. This is not uranium glass, by the way. If anything is uranium glass, I will show the glow before you throw the dough. I just thought of that on the fly, like literally just off the top of the head. That was pretty awesome. Somebody trademarked that. All right. So you have on the face of the slipper is a cat's head. And then you have your classic daisy and button pattern on the shoe. Um, and like I said, there's no cracks or chips on this, but there is like something inside of the glass right there. I don't know if you can see it, but it's in there. Like you can't, <laughs> you can't feel it. It's crazy. But I don't know. These shoes are awesome. And just like putting this, like you could see the light go through it right there. Putting that in a window. Oh man. Like this is, this screams just like, there's so much you can do with this. It's a rad piece. Um, now, as far as the maker goes, I know a lot of these have been attributed to Fenton. Um, this particular one just didn't, didn't look like the lot. So many glass companies made these um, pieces that a lot of times it's very difficult to know the maker. So unless I feel a hundred percent confident or I know, then I will, um, I won't give it, a, I won't label it just because I, I try to be as honest as, as possible. Um, and I didn't feel 100% labeling this Fenton, but it's an awesome piece. It doesn't matter who made it at this point. And the green slipper with the cat head, daisy, and button can be yours for a price of only $8 with the number 11. Give me number 11, and you walk away with the shoe. 
You just don't wear the shoe because I don't know if it will fit. Carolina lady, you are the winner. Congratulations. Carolina lady. Winner, winner, green slipper dinner. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Next up, here we go. Now, this is a this to me, this is this is another one of those pieces where it's just like I, I mean the quality of it is just up there. Quality is always gonna be good. But functionality i just i see so many different things you could do with this you know and and i understand that some people are collectors they want to just take it and they want to just put it up somewhere you know what i'm saying and there's nothing wrong with that but my main thing is is whatever it takes to get somebody to be drawn to these vintage and antique items is super important to me because i'm trying to to uh to spread the love of vintage and antiques. So like if, if somebody wants this sort of, this is like straight restaurant wear, you know, made, made in America. Uh, this is Wellsville, China, made in Ohio. The name of the pattern is Florette. Uh, and this is just like, I mean, it's an oval serving dish of sorts, you know, probably used for olives, um, relish, maybe nuts. And it measures nine and three fourths by four and a half and it's a it's a beautiful pattern um as you can see and then the quality like i said this is nice restaurant wear style china made in america um like an artist you could totally put your paint brushes in there uh i mean you could use it for food there's so much you can do oh i gotta stop really quick Shout outs to Eric, OBX Picker. He did it. He made it over 1K. Congratulations, my man. You you definitely deserve it. Definitely deserve it. What's going on, Joey? How you doing, brother? So yeah, this can be yours for a price of only $8 if you give me number 53. Number 53 gets you the Wellsville florette pattern, restaurant wear, Oval dish. Really, really nice piece. All right, we have a winner. Blue Flamingo Mercantile. Congratulations. Congratulations, Lori. You are the winner. Right. All right. Two more pieces coming your way. We got a lot of bright colors here today. A lot of bright colors. I like that. I like the bright colors. All right. So this is a really nice piece as well. Um, you're going to see this is made by Smith Glass. It does have the marking down there on the bottom. Uh, the name of this pattern is Quintec, Q-U-I-N-T-E-C. Um, this is a piece that is considered to be a nappy, um, is what they call these sort of bowls with handles right here. Uh, this is just gorgeous. I mean, look at look at look at the way that that light hits that piece, and you can just see the detail in there as well. Really nice blue, yeah. Oh my vintage, a really gorgeous blue color for sure. Um, it definitely just hits. It, it's just a really nice piece, and it's uh. From the handle to the bowl lip is six and a half inches, and height is about two and a half inches. And I believe I have this piece listed right now for $39.99. Uh, it is really gorgeous. Just a really gorgeous blue color and so much detail. So 
You can have this Smith nappy in the Quintec pattern. This sort of like ice blue color can be yours for only $13. Like I said, right now I have it listed for $39.99. And it can be yours with the number three for $13. Smith glass Quintec blue nappy. Gorgeous piece. Gorgeous, gorgeous piece. Stacy, you are the winner. Winner, winner, ice blue glass dinner. Yeah, Ellie Smith, just gorgeous blue. It really is. Congratulations, Stacy. All right. Next up, we have, this is a really awesome cat. So I know you guys liked the cats last time. So I'm going to try and bring out some cat. I'm going to try and bring animals for every live sale now. Cats, dogs. I got an owl tonight. I know somebody had told me they like owls, so I got a really nice owl. Um, but, yeah, I'm going to try and bring animals every live sale now. But check this guy out. Look at this cat. I mean, the eyes. Look at the eyes. Can you see the eyes? There it is. I mean, it's like a like a sky blue in there. Now, it's really interesting um, when you find these uh, cats with the blue eyes. They always are uh, high, more sought after and appealing if they have color in the eyes. Um, and this one has a little bit of light blue in there. And just the way that the – it's like a, a, a matte finish almost. And the way that the paint was done, it kind of just – it look at how the texture and the paint are on the chest of the cat. It just to me is a lot of like tiny details like that that go into a really nice piece. And, and I think that this is shown in, the, in this cat right here. And there's, you know – the ears are in good shape, nose, no issues. It's just a really nice piece. Now, there's no marking on this, uh, but this is definitely old. Uh, it's got a lot of um, just real nice appeal to it. I, I, I don't know why. I really like this cat. Uh, I mean, it sits. Let me tell you how tall it is. To the top of the ear of the cat is seven inches tall so this is a nice size one too as you can tell i feel like i just won an award like at the cat oscars or something i just want to first of all i gotta thank my dukes for for helping me win this award of the cat cat awards the cat oscars the cat emmys this cat trophy can be yours for a price of nine dollars with the number 12 number 12 gets you the blue eyed cat blue eyed cat blue eyed cat don't you like the blue eyed cat blue eyed cat blue eyed cat don't you like the blue eyed cat blue eyed cat number 12 nine dollars And the winner is Victoria. Congratulations, Victoria. You are the winner. Oh, what did I do with my pen? Here we go. Hey, Barb, how's it going? Thanks for stopping by. Congratulations, Victoria. I would send, I would sing you the winner, winner dinner song, but it doesn't work with cats. So, all right, time to grab two more pieces. 
where do I get all my energy from? I don't know. It's crazy. I, I, I get my energy from you guys, you know, you guys give me the energy. I, I'm just here. I hope that, you know, you guys enjoy the show. Like even if people aren't buying, they get a chance to like learn something, have a good time, good energy. This is how I am all the time. So I, I hope I'm not too much for you guys, but like, I'm going to keep it real. This is, this is who I am. So I hope you guys enjoy it. That Red Bull he showed us earlier. Don't tell anybody. I'm not supposed to be drinking those. All right, we're gonna go oval now. Yeah, I do have I have a little bit of that in me too, for sure. <laughs> All right, so these are gonna be oval pieces. All right, this first piece, this is a little bit older than just vintage. It's not necessarily antique, but it's definitely got some age to it. Now. For those of you that don't know about Clarice Cliff, Clarice Cliff is one of the best in the game, hands down. The designs span over years, um, just amazing stuff. So this is um, Royal Staffordshire, and um, this is by Clarice Cliff, made in England. And it is in one of the more well-known patterns of Tonquin, as you can see right there. Uh, this is a brown one, and this is technically considered to be a bonbon. Uh, it does have the perforated handles or the ears, as some people refer to it as. And you can just see, obviously, the immense detail that goes into this piece. It is just absolutely stunning. And this piece measures to be... It's a pinch over six and a quarter inches by four and a quarter inches just uh, this is something that is you know that you hold on to i've sold so much clarice cliff tonquin it's incredible like so much of it it's wild and it it goes for really good money especially certain pieces uh so i think i have this piece listed for 34.99 right now uh, and so I'm giving you gonna give you guys a deal. That's what we're here for. We're here. We're here for you guys to enjoy yourselves and get some deals. So Royal Staffordshire, Clarice Cliff, Bonbon, only thirteen dollars. If you give me number fourteen, this is a steal of a deal. Look at the detail, gorgeous piece. Royal Staffordshire, Clarice Cliff. Number 14 for $13. Let's go. And I'm going to move on to the next one. All right. Okay. Put that guy down. We'll bring him back out in a little bit. All right. Next piece is... This is Super Mid-Century Modern. This is actually kind of one of my favorite pieces I think I brought out for the night. I just... The color scheme is just super dope. All right. Here you go. So you got this gray. And then you have like that speckled yellow on the inside. Oh, man. Super rad. Divided dish. I mean, this screams mid-century modern. Um, and it is made by Harker. Harker Ware. And you can see it is marked on the bottom right there for you. Harker Ware. Super. The owl soon. Yeah, I'm going to. I'll I'll bring the owl out within the next two pieces for you. And. As you can see, it is divided. Now, I love this, too, because of the lines. So, you know, it's gray on the outside. And it just and, and the way that they paint it, it just looks completely flat, right? 
when you flip it over, they add the gray line right here in the middle, but they don't go all the way to the edge. And just to me, that's like one of those things that just makes it kind of like pop out a little bit more. Uh, and this is super versatile. You can put this in your kitchen. You can put this in your dining room. You can put this in your living room, your TV room. It goes anywhere. And another thing that I like to point out too that's really dope about this piece, I don't know if you'll be able to see it or not, but it, it has speckles. It, the yellow is speckled too. So it's almost like a uh, eggshell, I guess sometimes they're referred to as when you have those sort of speckles on, uh, on a paint. Uh, it is just a really rad piece. Uh, and this oval mid-century modern dish measures 10 and a quarter inches by seven and a quarter. So 10 and a quarter by seven and a quarter. There you go. My man Patrick from Trusty Huckster dropping knowledge on us. So this piece can be yours for a price of only $13 with the number 63 Number 63. Yeah, the colors are awesome. I love the colors on this. That gray, yellow, it's just super rad. $13 for the Harker divided oval dish, gray and yellow. $13. Number 63. All right. We will put those two away for now, and I will grab two more items. No. All right. So, first up, I figured, oh, like, you know, this can appeal to a lot of people. I just think this is a really cool piece. Um, this is a Walt Disney piece. Um, and you can see it is marked on the back. Uh, if it focuses, it's kind of tough to see. But it is marked Walt Disney on the back. This is your boy, Pluto. Say hello to Pluto. This is a frosted glass. Um, it is Pluto. I don't know who the cat is. If anybody in the chat knows who the cat is, please let me know. I think it's Aristocrat, but I don't, I, don't quote me on it. This is a really awesome frosted glass Pluto figurine. Walt Disney. Um, this piece measures to be to the tip of Pluto's nose. I can't see. Felix Cleo is the cat. So the tip of Pluto's nose is going to be a pinch under four inches. Uh, and the base of this Figaro, Cleo Figaro, everybody has, nope, who's, what's the cat's name? It's about three, pinch more than three and a half inches on the base. So this is a really rad Pluto and the cat, either Figaro, Felix, or Cleo. Let's see if I can get you in a little closer on the cat. Nope, not going to get there. It's a really pretty piece, though. So, the Walt Disney Pluto Frosted Glass Figurine can be yours for a price of $11 with the number 16. Blue Flamingo Mercantile. Congratulations. You are the winner. I can't do a winner, winner dinner on this one either. It just doesn't feel right. 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's owl time. Now, I actually have this owl. Let me just look it up real quick and tell you how much I actually have it listed for. So I currently have this owl listed at $39.99 on my Etsy store. Now this is a Bing in Grondel, uh, Copenhagen, as you can see the marking right down there on the bottom. So this is a really high quality, nice piece, well made owl, um, as you can see right there. And the detail all the way around. This is a super nice piece. I actually bought a lot of um, these Bing and Grondel uh, figurines. And I think this is actually the last one I have left. But this is a really nice piece here. Um, and this owl measures to be... <clears throat> Let's see, the owl is four and a half inches to the tip of his ear. Uh, very nice piece right here. As you can see, I'll give you an up close of the owl one more time. Give you a round. I like the claws too. Nice detail on the claws there. Really nice owl. So, like I said, I have it listed at either $34.99 or $39.99. But I'm going to give it to you guys for a price of $19 for the Bing and Grondel Owl figurine. Cool. Can be yours for a price. I mean, uh, <laughs> number 42. $19. Number 42 gets you the Bing and Grondel Owl figurine. And Lori, the Blue Flamingo Mercantile, is first to claim. Congratulations, Lori. You are the winner. All right. What is this guy? Take these two back. All right, so I guess it's time to get some glowing in here. But before we get to the glow, I got some more awesome, like, uh, I guess there's those, those cozy coaster glasses. These ones are actually handmade. Um, they're all together on a safety pin. Let me pull it off really quick. See if I can't get one of them off. Yeah, here we go. All right. So these are super old vintage. I mean, look at these. These are hand knitted. And you can see. And these are for your Collins glasses, I guess. Now these are a little bit tighter than the other ones, I think. But there you go. Look at that. Pretty rad stuff. And I don't know they're like if they're like oh they're almost like are they seashells on the top? I think they might be seashells up there on the top. Really rad. Um so these were bought many many years ago. And I think they're from the 50s or 60s and it says handmade glass jackets. I guess that's what it says. So, I mean, for like from 1960s, 50s, they were four for a dollar fifty. So, 
now i don't know what that equates to in now time but grandma's beer yes but you can have all four of these red and white there is one two three four all four of these for a price of only seven dollars with the number seven seven for seven grandma's glass jackets <laughs> You got it, Julie. Seven for number seven, seven dollars. All right. All right. It's crochet, not knitted. Crochet, yes. Sorry. I'm not that hip. I'm learning. <laughs> Okay, so this next piece, what do I do with the ticket? What do I do with the tickets? Oh. All right. So this is a little bit of everything everybody likes. Now... Buffering like crazy. Is everybody anybody else having trouble seeing me? If anybody else is having trouble seeing me, please let me know. All right. So this is a Fenton Fairy Light in the Persian medallion pattern. So you have the bottom and you have the top, right? So technically there's a third piece to this. And you can see the, let me see if I can get you guys close so you can see the pattern. And there it is. Persian medallion. So this is custard satin by Fenton. And it is marked Fenton on the bottom. Uh, you might be able to see it. Let me turn this off. Uh, it's kind of difficult to see, but it's marked Fenton. And this is a fairy light, as you can see. So you can still find the middle glass, clear glass piece that is used to have this sit um, flush with. Um, you can still use it, as you can see, but it does. It's supposed to have a clear glass piece in the middle to help that sit flush. Um, and this is uranium glass, so it does glow, as you can see. And I'll show you the top piece that glows. Really gorgeous. And that just glows green, green, green. If you could see the uh, pattern. So it's a really awesome piece. Fenton Fairy Light, Persian Medallion Pattern, Uranium Glass, Custard Satin, an awesome piece. And only $19. Yeah, this piece sells easily for anywhere from $35 to $45. It's an awesome Fenton uranium glass, custard satin, Persian medallion, fairy light, number five. Gets you the fairy light. Blue Flamingo Mercantile with the win. Congratulations, Lori. You are the winner. Winner, winner, fairy light dinner. All right. Thank you very much, Bell26, bunny dancing to punk music. That's, that is a tongue twister. <laughs> We're flying tonight, guys. We are flying. All right. Whew. Got my hands full. 
Christy Garza. Hello, hello. All right. That's that's that. Okay. We'll do these guys first. This. This one was tough for me to, to, to throw you guys, but I love y'all, and I do this for y'all. Well, I do this for me too, or else I won't be able to pay my bills. But <laughs> boom, look at these. Now, there's cobalt blue, and then there's hall cobalt blue. So these are bud vases, and they are made by Hall China. And they are marked, as you can see. Go ahead and look that up. Kablam! Hall China 631. Look that up on eBay right now. Some of these, if you can even find it in the cobalt blue, some of them sell for $20 just for one single bud vase. You're not going to get one. You get kablam! You get two. Mid-century modern cobalt blue Hall China bud vases. I mean, look at these. Look at how that cobalt blue looks on the light. And I mean, just the shape of these. The shape of them is awesome. Super clean. Really, really nice pieces. And made in the good old US of A. So these bud vases measure to about six and a quarter, six and a half inches tall. Um, just a really nice piece of, of, of Paul China. If you guys watch us enough, live sales, live streams are pre recorded We always talk about Hall China. I'm, we're huge fans. They make high quality stuff um, and they just make it in really nice colors and just a wide variety of shapes, sizes, patterns, designs. It's just awesome stuff. So you get both of these Hall China cobalt blue bud vases, both of them, only $17 with number 69 number 69 17 dollars gets you the hall mid cent modern cobalt blue bud vases blue flamingo is on a roll number 69 goes to lori the blue flamingo mercantile congratulations Blue Flamingo, you are the winner. Winner, winner, bud vase dinner. Winner, winner, bud vase dinner. Oh, I love those pieces. They're so nice. All right. Sorry, Nate. You can't even find them on e the same ones on eBay. Yeah, that's what... Listen, you know, I know sometimes I come off maybe like a car salesman, but I'm being dead honest with you guys. Like this is, you know, I, I'm doing this to try and give people an opportunity if you're a reseller to resell them or if you're a collector to get a deal. Because I appreciate you guys coming here and supporting me and what I do. So, you know, it's only right for me to try my best to give you guys the best price possible. So sorry, Nate. You know, I love you, brother. <laughs> All right, this is a really unique piece. Um, so it's in like a blue willow, but the pattern is actually called Phoenix Rising or Rising Phoenix. And then you can really see the detail in that Phoenix. Um, and this is the, what makes this piece so unique is the size. Um, this is, it's not a miniature, it's not a full size, but it is just, you know, this really unique size. Uh, and, and I love how the, the design goes on the handle, too. Super unique. Um, only other one that is Edgewater Vase for $90. Yeah, see? Really awesome piece here. And this is uh, has a Japan marking on the bottom. There it is. Uh, and this little guy... Part of a child set, possibly. It, it, it could be, but to me, I mean, it's still a little bit big, maybe, to be in a child set. It's just, it's a very unique piece, but you might be right for sure. Uh, 
And this measures to about three and a quarter inches. I think I have this piece up for $25 right now on my Etsy store. Um, but once again, I'm going to give you guys the bargain of the night. Well, no, there's a couple more pieces to come that you that I have one piece that is the ultimate bargain of the night. Like it's going to be crazy. So Phoenix Rising, Blue Willowish Creamer, made in Japan. See that guy? See that guy? Ten dollars only. Number fifty nine, and it's blue and white. Blue and white is like the hottest decor right now you can get out there. Carolina lady, coming in with the win. Congratulations, Carolina lady. You are the winner, winner, rising phoenix dinner. All right. Oh, I'm getting old. I played 18 holes of golf the other day. I'm super sore. All right, so <sighs> what's going on, Bill? How you doing, brother? All right, so I know you guys really like the Fenton custard stuff, so I do have – what's going on, Daddy? How you doing? We got – um, I have two more pieces of the custard satin Fenton glass for you guys. One of them is going to be coming up shortly. All right. So this next piece, <sighs> this next piece is going to be a very interesting one. So now I'm probably going to butcher this saying, but it's, <sighs> I can't, <laughs> this is so tough to say. I, you know what? Somebody who, I want to see if anybody can type what this is in the chat. Schneider schnitzel, shiner schnitzel. It's like when they cut the, it's like paper cut, but this is like a shadow box version of it. It's kind of difficult to see. You can kind of see it in there a little bit, how it's like a, it's a shatter, shadow box. No, they're birds in a tree. Peacocks, maybe. Schnitzel, weiner schnitzel, schnitzel schneider. I can't say it. I'm trying really hard, but I can't. <laughs> Laser cut. <laughs> no, I, I I took a picture of it to try and figure to remember how to say it. Uh, where is it? I don't think I have the picture anymore. Shoot. Oh, there it is. Here we go. Schneider Schnitt. Schirner Schnitt. It's a German pronunciation, which means scissor cuts. There you go. Thank you, Bill. That's how you spell it. I don't know if that's how you say it, though. But this is a real, I mean, this is an old piece, guys. This is super old. Uh, I mean, a, you can just tell, too, by, you know, the way that this is. Tim's just swearing in German now. You can just tell it's got AIDS, too, by the way this is put together here. I mean, and this is a shadow box uh, frame, and you have the birds in there and a tree. Yeah, it, it, this is how you spell it. It, it means paper uh, scissor cutting in German. Uh, but yeah, this is a super rad piece. Very, very unique. This is not one that you're going to just find anywhere at all. Really rad piece. Like some of the Schneider Schnitz, they go for like, you know, 50, 60 bucks, some of them. And I mean, for me, this is just a very different piece. It might not even be Schneider Schnitt, 
but it's just I don't I can't tell you what it is. I didn't want to open the back because I think the back has this sort of old school vibe to it too, but it is just a really unique piece. And the Schneider, the she earn schnitt, she earned schnitt can be yours for a price of only $14 with the number 13. Number 13, $14 gets you Schneider Schneet. She earned Schneet. Really rad piece. Aaron Rebel Junk. Aaron coming in for the win. Congratulations, Aaron Rebel Junk. You are the winner, winner, Schneider Schneit dinner. Oh. All right. Okay. You guys ready for some more Fenton custard glass? Some more uranium glass? You guys ready? Here we have a... Now, I wish you guys could see the patterns on these. The light is kind of crucial. I'm trying to. But this is a paneled daisy pattern. Let's see if I cut this off a little bit. It has the Fenton stickers still inside which is super rad and it is paneled daisy and it is uranium glass look at that glue super rad piece no the fun didn't end the fun just started so this fenton glass Custard satin paneled daisy toothpick holder uranium glass, which measures a pinch over three and a half inches tall, can be yours for a price of only nine dollars. Are you kidding me? Nine dollars. With number 18. Hey, Mary. 18. $9 gets you the Fenton Custard Satin Uranium Glass Panel Daisy Toothpick Holder. Whoa, the 18s are flying in. All right. Kathy, you are the winner. Congratulations to Kathy. Winner, winner, Fenton dinner. All right. Time to grab. Oh, time to grab a couple more pieces. I'm going to go back and look at the number on the picture. The number on the picture was 13. I think Aaron Rebel Junk entered 14, but I'm assuming that she, she meant 13 because, you know, and I might have said number 14. So, but I went ahead and gave it to her because I'm pretty sure that that's what the situation was. I, I give a little leeway on the typos. All right. So let me grab a... Oh, I got... I got to go. Oh.
Oh, some of this stuff is not easy to carry by myself. All right. Woo. It's getting hot in here. It's getting hot in here. All right. All right. Yeah, trust me. I would have given it to Patrick, you know, because I love Patrick. Patrick's my man. But that I think that's – have a good night, Maria. Thanks for stopping by. All right. Here we go. First up is going to be – let me get these glasses out of the way. We're going to do these first. All right. Most of you probably know what this is. Hazel Atlas. Sailboats. Ships. White ships on cobalt blue. You get one. You get two. You get all three of the Hazel Atlas ships. Mid-century modern glasses. And they got the little seagulls on them too if you haven't seen these up close and personal before. These are super mid-century modern. One of the like, you know, I, I, mean, I wouldn't necessarily say iconic, but a lot of people know about this stuff. They, I mean, the Hazel Atlas sailboats or ships, however you want to refer to it as, are super, super, you know, popular. Um, it's pretty awesome stuff. So, you guys, these are the, I forget which tumblers these are. Because some of these, um, these glasses can be super expensive depending upon the size of them. Um, these glasses are a pinch under five inches tall. Uh, I think I have these up for like 40 bucks right now uh, for the three. I'm going to give them to you guys basically. $13 for all three of the Hazel Atlas sailboat five-inch tumbler glasses with the number four. Number four gets you three Hazel Atlas sailboat ship mid-century modern glasses boom and stacy you are the winner 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 hazel atlas sailboat dinner congratulations stacy all right next up these are really cool these are these, uh, they're like pin dishes, I guess technically is what you would call them. They are Royal Wooster. Royal Wooster made in England. And they have the absolutely most gorgeous floral design on the inside of those. Look at that. That is an awesome bouquet of flowers. And you get two. Whoa, where did that come from? Boom. Two. Royal Wooster really coasters <laughs> oh, i know you love your coasters they could definitely be used as coasters for sure i mean let's just let's just test it boom boom shakalaka so yes royal booster pin dishes or coasters with the awesome really pretty floral design um, and these are about three and three fourths inches wide and you get the pair for $9 with the number 55, number 55, 55, 55, five. there he is. There he is in the clutch. Congratulations, Patrick. You are the winner. Trusty Huckster Mercantile. <sighs> 55, got it. All right, let's bring out some more uranium glass.
Whew. Man, I feel like I'm running an obstacle course right now. How you doing, buying space? All right. Let's start with the uranium glass. So here we go. Sugar and creamer. Um, this is Hazel Atlas. Uh, the name of the pattern is Ovide. Um, there's a little bit of cloudiness in this. Not, you know, anything crazy. Uh, but they are chip and crack free. A really just sort of sleek looking pair of depression glass uh, sugar and creamer. Um, these are made by Hazel Atlas. Uh, the name of the pattern is Ovide. And they glow. They glow green. I think it's better when I show you guys the pictures of them online, how they glow, because it's hard to see. But these are really gorgeous. Sugar and creamer. Hazel Atlas uranium glass. Steal of a price here. Steal of a price. Nine dollars. Number 71 gets you the sugar and the crema. 71. Uranium glass. Sugar and creamer. 71. And Steve. What's going on? Steve back alley garage in the building. Nine seventy one for nine dollars is back alley garage, my man Steve. Congratulations, winner, winner, uranium, sugar, and cream of dinner. All right. Now, next up, this is this is a really interesting one. So these are made in England. I, I have a lot of English China just because that's where the best stuff comes from. I mean, you you might some people might think different, but to me, English, porcelain, China, ceramic, all that from comes from England. It's just it's really good. Now this is Hammersley. Come on, focus. There you go. These are really <laughs> Austria whips England, but <laughs> I mean, you know, it, it, uh, we could debate that another day, but I'm not mad at you for that. Austria does make really gorgeous stuff for sure. Um, these are made by Hammersley. Like I said, these are really gorgeous salt and pepper shakers. And I think it's called oh, Violets, Wild Violets or something like that is the name of the pattern. Really gorgeous stuff. And it does have like the gold on the top and gold trim on the bottom. Now these probably sell, resell for about, I don't know, 30 30 to 40 dollars i think i have mine listed for 40 bucks right now which might be a little high but just gorgeous and you can see that the violets go all the way around and these are hand painted too um so everyone's a little bit different which is really rad so i have mine listed for 40 i'm gonna give them to you guys for 14 dollars if you can give me number 20 Number 20 for the Hammersley Violet Salt and Pepper Shakers. Gorgeous stuff. Look at that. Really pretty. Beautiful salt and pepper shakers. Hammersley, made in England. All right. It's so back to the store. All right. Okay. 
Oh, all right. We got two. We got a. We got some steals coming up. I'm gonna have to bring those. Say Spo two. I don't think so. I have to double check on that for you, Patrick. Give me one second. All right. No, Patrick, no spode on there. Yeah, they're old. There's a uh, there's no spode on those salt and pepper shakers. I mean, I try to tell people it's a steal at that price. All right, you guys want blue or pink? First person in the chat. I'm shipping from Maryland, Christy. All right, blue or pink? Somebody pick a color, blue or pink. Blue. Michelle's going blue. All right. So if you guys like that ice blue, check out this baby. Boom. Look at that shape. It's gorgeous shape. Gorgeous ice blue. Look at that ice blue. Look at that. Really rad pattern on there. Just the shape. I like. I love this sort of shape right here. And then the handle, handle shape too. Um, this is actually an interesting piece because this is a uh, collaboration piece. So I, I like some of these glass pieces that are collaboration pieces is what I call them. But sometimes it's like company, one company will make the glass for another company. Um, but so if you see the marking on there, you probably won't be able to see it. It's an S and an M. So this is a collaboration piece of Summit Glass and Moser Glass. So Summit and Moser make this together. This is a gorgeous ice blue. And like I said, just the, the shape of this, the cut of this is just really, really rad. Um, I will give you guys a measurement to the tip of the spouts. It is going to be about... Uh, six and a half inches to the tip of the spout. And it can be yours. This can be yours for a price of only $13 with helmet shape. I like that. Number 72. Number 72 gets you ice blue. 72 for the ice blue. Who wants the ice blue? Number 72, Victoria. Congratulations, Victoria. You are the winner. Winner, winner, ice blue dinner. Congratulations. All right. Now, this next piece is an absolutely stunning piece. Of Fenton glass. Look at that. This is a Fenton. Um, it doesn't. Fenton melon vase. There's the sticker. See the sticker in there? Fenton melon ribbed. I mean, it is absolutely gorgeous. This is like a, a pink satin glass. So it has that satin finish to it. Yeah, I know. Oh, wow is right. I mean, this is just a stunner of a piece. Absolutely gorgeous. And I'm going to, this is a steal of a price right now. $18 gets you this absolutely stunning Fenton pink satin pitcher. And I'll tell you, to the tip of the spout is 
about five and a quarter inches tall. $18 for the Fenton pitcher. Give me number 39. Jackie, congratulations, Jackie. You are the winner. That is a gorgeous piece. All right, we're motoring on, guys. We're almost there. All right, we are down to our last seven pieces, okay, guys? Down to our last seven pieces. All right, so I'm going to give you this one first, guys. This is an absolute – this is the steal of the show, 100%. This is a Fenton – Topaz opalescent Vaseline glass basket weave flower vase. Just an absolute stunning piece of glass. And this does glow, as you can see. And it glows really nice. Now, I mean, it's just, it's gorgeous. I don't even I, I really shouldn't even have to say anything else because this is when, the, when you see the price you're gonna lose your mind on the steel that this is gonna be. It's about a three and a quarter inches tall and it's four and a half inches wide. Fenton glass basket weave flower vase, topaz opalescent. I mean this is easily like a fifty dollar piece, no questions. $24, number 40, gets you this beautiful Fenton Topaz Opalescent Basket Weave Flower Vase. KC Addicts, you are the winner. Congratulations. Winner, winner, Topaz Opalescent Dinner. All right. Next up, this is probably one of my favorite pieces of the night, too. Because you just, I've never seen one of these before, ever. So do you see this? This is glass. Still have the price tag in there from when I had it at the flea market. I had it for $24.99. So this is glass but it has a complete silver overlay i mean super 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 mid-century modern it's got the ice lip on the picture and you can see it's glass and it does have a marking on the bottom it says authentic silver light on glass come on focus Ah, I can't get it. There it is. So authentic silver lights on glass, mid-century modern picture. I mean, you'll you just you find me one another one of these because I haven't been able to find one. And this is six and a quarter inches tall, absolutely amazing. Steal of a price, eleven dollars. Number 34. Patrick is the winner. Trusty Huckster Mercantile. Congratulations, brother. 
Winner, winner, silver light dinner. All right. <sighs> You're right. You can't find it. I know. It's crazy. All right, here we go. We got one more piece of uranium glass after this next piece I'm about to show you. You guys might have seen this before. I have had quite a few of these on the sales already. All of them are in different colors. This one is a straight Vaseline color. These are made by Boyd, I believe. They're colonial... Uh, late colonial ladies or southern bells, some people call them, but yeah, that whole bad boy glows and it glows like a beast. Gorgeous piece, colonial lady Vaseline glass, southern bell, really pretty piece. And it's about to be a steal. Here comes the steal. $12, number 29, gets you the Vaseline Glass Southern Bell. Christy Garza, congratulations, Christy. You are the winner. Uh, all right. And next up, I love these. <clears throat> They're just super cute to me. Hazel Atlas, um, Little Hostess. So they're almost like uh, kids. Little Hostess, Sugar and Creamer. And they are in the pink color. It's kind of difficult to see, but these are pink. So you get the little creamer. And you get the little sugar. The super, like... Mid-century modern colors, but deco lines on the handles. Really cool pieces. Really cute. Only $9. Give me number 22 for the Hazel Atlas, Little Hostess, Sugar, and Creamer. 22. Jackie, you are the winner. Congratulations, Jackie. All right, we are down to the wire, ladies and gentlemen. All right, here we go. Boom. All right, we're going to go back to back pink. I love this. This is a pink satin. And this is made by Viking Glass. It's almost like a handkerchief vase, but it's not. Um, this is actually considered to be a compote, according to Viking Glass. Um, the name of the pink is called Epic Pink, um, and it's just like a pink satin glass. It's got a little bit of, uh, you know, it gets a little darker down here by the stem. It's really nice. See, it's got a little this pattern on the bottom, too, as you can see. This is really, really cool. Um, let me give you a measurement really quick. Uh, this measures to about six and three fourths inches tall. This is a Viking glass satin pink compote. 
technically, but you can use it for a lot of stuff. Um, I just think, I mean, that shape is just fabulous. It's a really rad piece. And it can be yours for a price of $11 with the number 24. Number 24 gets you the epic pink Viking satin glass. Lori, congratulations. Blue Flamingo with the win. All right, guys. The last piece of Fenton Satin. The last piece of Custard Glass. The last piece of Uranium Glass. Do, 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 do. Persian Medallion Pattern. Fenton Custard Glass Compote. Beautiful. Yes, it is. And does it glow? Oh, yes, it glows. You know I show the glow before you throw the dough. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful piece. Fenton glass. Persian medallion. Compote. This beauty stands tall at six and a half inches. Yes, does match the uh, fairy light. Six and a half inches, same pattern. Persian medallion is the name of the pattern. And this beauty can be yours. What's going on, Dave, Tesla Picker? Listen, if you guys are not subscribed to Dave, the Tesla Picker, you got to do so. One of the most awesome people on YouTube, nicest guy, great family. He shows you all different types, sides of reselling. He makes awesome socks, which are rad, crazy socks, and dope shirts. So definitely subscribe to Tesla Picker. He is the man. So Fenton Glass, Custard Glass, Persian Medallion can be yours for a price of $17 with the number 17. 17 for 17. Fenton, Custard Glass, Persian Medallion. Christy Garza, congratulations. You are the winner. Winner, winner, Fenton Glass dinner. I know you guys love the Fenton Custard Glass. I'm going to keep trying to bring you guys some more of that and give you some good prices. Congratulations, Christy Garza. All right. We got one more piece left, guys. Last item of the night. All right. Now, these are vintage for sure, right? They're not like super old, like antique vintage, but they're vintage. And they are just awesome. I don't know what, what it is about these that I like so much. I just think, I guess it's just the uniqueness of them. They're just a little bit different than normal uh, sugar uh, cups and saucers. But these are rad. Look at this. How awesome is that? So the saucer is has like this, like this piece right here. So it like raises and then dips back down. So when the cup sits in there, it's almost like it's flat inside the saucer. Super rad stuff. And it's like these, it's like a mat. So it's it's matte. It's like a matte black and it has the yellow flowers on there and this is the maker for you come on there you go these are made in spain um block Birasol, uh espana sevilla 
So these are made in Spain, and it's not just one. Because I can't just sell you one because, you know, what if there's two of you? But you get two cups and two saucers. Really rad pieces here. Just unique. I like unique. I like different. I'm a different guy. You can get both of these cups and saucers for only $15 with the number 56. 56 gets you two cups and saucers made in Spain. Really awesome. Never seen anything like these out in the wild. Debbie from Chicago comes in with the win. Congratulations, Debbie from Chicago. You are the winner. Debbie from Chicago. Congratulations. Those are really, really awesome pieces. I'm going to just go put these back really fast. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to conclude tonight's live sale. Before we go, I just want to thank everybody again one more time. Um, this means the world to me that so many people show up to these live sales and support what we do. Um, I work really, really hard. I work a lot of long days, a lot of long hours, and I got to sh show a little bit more love to, to Patrick, the trusty Huxer Mercantile, because if it wasn't for him, you know, I probably wouldn't be able to meet a lot of you guys on the other side of this screen. It's been super difficult for me to cross over into the vintage world. Um, I've been doing vintage and antiques for like three or four years now. So like to finally be able to you know, connect with that side of YouTube. It means a lot. And I can't thank you guys enough for your support. You guys are here all the time. And I hope you guys have fun and enjoy yourselves because um, this does mean a lot to me. And I have fun doing it or else I wouldn't do it. So thank you guys again, as always. Um, if you send me your information to the email, scrolling across the bottom of the screen, I will get you guys um, invoices sent out tomorrow. Um, and then we really try to get everything turned around in 24 to 48 hours. So we send out these packages as early as Wednesday. Some of the packages go out as early as Tuesday, tomorrow. So the quicker you guys can send the information, we get it packed, invoices sent, and then shipped out. So thank you guys once again, as always. For tuning in it's been a blast i hope you guys have a wonderful night i'm looking at all the comments and thank you guys so much i really means a lot mark barb carrie patrick stacy jackie thank you guys thank you guys so much um everybody have a great night and we'll see you guys soon peace